Hey guys, I'm Nisha Homi and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm showing you some of the organic stuffs I got from RARS Ambala Oil, which I use in my daily cooking. In my where I shop organics video, I have already shared from where I shop organics. You can check the video. The links will be down below in the description box. I got some organic squashes for my kids. This is mango squash and it is one liter and cost 160 rupees. This is ginger squash and it cost 80 rupees. Pineapple squash and it's also 80 rupees for 500 ml. And this is a raw mango squash. This is what we call Kandari Molaga Uppilitada or Piri Piri chilies in brine. Nothing but Piri Piri chilies, salt and organic vinegar. You can very easily make it at home but when I saw this uh, I was tempted to buy. Because it is organic I bought this. This is Kandari Achar. Same thing. Uh, with some added spices some cinnamon there was some international jackfruit festival going on there so they were really in short of uh, cinnamon and black pepper so i could just get hold of around uh, 150 grams now this is the main thing i get from there it is uh, single polished white rice and this is single polished white rice i use this rice for my daily cooking and uh, if you are a regular on my channel you might have seen me using this particular rice in the rice dishes i have shown it has some bran left on the rice it's actually white rice but with some bran left on the rice I also use this rice to make South Indian dishes like idli, dosha, puta, appam, vattayappam, patri, idiyappam. Now the only issue with this organic single polished rice is I have to store this carefully. Insects do get in since it is organic so I have to put it in a glass or a steel container and cover it tightly. This is uh, Navara rice. This rice has a uh, lot of medicinal values. This rice is known as Navara rice or Navara rice. It's a very special variety of rice grown only in Kerala. This cost 100 rupees for 1 kg. It has many medicinal properties and is used in Ayurveda for treatment of many diseases. Navara rice is an excellent rice for babies, lactating mothers. Navara is also very good for children who has anemia. And the best part is it can be consumed by people of all ages. The specialty of this rice is that it gets matured in about 60 days. Another thing is that it is recommended for people with piles skin diseases it helps to strengthen bones so it is very good for osteoarthritis and it helps to relieve arthritic pain also so it is very good for people with arthritis osteoarthritis rheumatoid arthritis etc it helps to boost your immunity so during the month of karkadagam this rice is used to make marinu kanji or karkada kanji i have also shown this rice in my herbal ladu or marununda you can check that video to know more about this oh I also forgot to mention that this rice is an excellent remedy for anemia as it helps to promote the growth of red blood cells. I got 2 kgs of Navara rice. This is black gram and it's 100 rupees for 1 kg. This is jackfruit powder. It's actually made with raw jackfruit which is sun dried or dehydrated and then made into a powder. This is half kg and it cost 200 rupees. Jackfruit is uh, one fruit that can be consumed as a meal to replace your regular carbohydrate such as wheat or rice. I bought 2 kgs of jackfruit powder. And one more thing I like to mention is please don't call me Nisha ma'am. To me you are my friends and I try to bring more healthier meal options for you. Call me Akka, Didi, Chechi or simply my name. Ma'am just sounds too official and you know there will be a gap between us. I don't want that. I like to be your friend. I want to make your meals as healthy as possible and help you to change your lifestyle in a healthier and simpler and economical way you always ask me questions doubts and I try to help you out as much as possible because I want to help you to change your lifestyle please take it as a small request from me call me anything you can call me my name you can call me Akka Didi but just don't call me ma'am now the main issue with this organic stuffs is insects do get in pretty fast ants do get in pretty fast always try to store your grocery or your snacks or whatever you make in a glass or a steel container 
this is something called vadig i have not had this before but they said this tastes really nice with the rice or kanji so i just bought it just to see how it tastes and uh, they told me that this is actually like a kondatam and now what you have to do is just heat coconut oil and lightly fry this and then you can have this with your meals like rice or kanji it has a uh, raw jackfruit raw banana spices like green chilies curry leaves shallots everything they uh, rolled it and then sun dried it this is uh, coconut chutney powder or tenga chamanti podi this is uh, chukku podi or uh, dry ginger powder i bought this to make turmeric tea mix i've already shared that recipe you can check the description box below for the recipe link another main ingredient which i simply love this is turmeric powder it is uh, 40 rupees for 200 grams turmeric dry ginger powder or chukku podi cinnamon and black pepper will be used to make my turmeric tea mix I got 3 packets of uh, turmeric powder 200 grams each this is raw banana powder i might make some porridge or i might add it in my roti or chila this is jackfruit halwa and this is jackfruit toffee actually this is chakka varatiyad they have uh, wrapped it in a uh, butter paper this is an excellent after meal sweet definitely a healthier option to chocolates and toffees or when you crave for something sweet and i also got some virgin coconut oil and this actually a friend gave us two bottles of virgin coconut oil try to store your uh, rice and other grocery items in a glass container so this is uh, navara or navara rice So this is urad dal with its skin. Urad dal is uh, one of the richest source of protein, vitamin B, iron, folic acid, calcium, magnesium and potassium. I like to transfer each and everything into clean dried glass containers. And one thing I like to mention about uh, jackfruit powder is if you're diabetic then you should try to include jackfruit powder in your diet. I did mention that there was a shortage for cinnamon and uh, black pepper. It was because there was some jackfruit international festival going on there. They had so many varieties of jackfruit on display there like dried jackfruit, jackfruit chips, jackfruit halwa, jackfruit toffee, jackfruit powder. So many different varieties made from some raw and ripe jack fruits were on display there so i got a chance to see all those it does have a nice uh, subtle jack fruit flavor i'm sure everybody knows to make banana powder it's just sun drying raw bananas and then grinding it to a fine powder flavor wise it has a very neutral flavor Turmeric is my favorite spice. It has a nice golden color. This turmeric is from the farm in the research station. It is 100% organic and one of the best quality turmeric powder. Hope you enjoyed watching this video and until next time, take care. Bye bye.